So Chandler and I met in 2008. It was seventh grade middle school. Um, we had to sit in alphabetical order in PE. I had just transferred out of a avid class because it's too much stupid work for me. So my schedule got swished and I ended up in the same PE class as her. I sat behind him because Gustus and Hannafin. She would always check me out because obviously she was behind me, so. At the time, I didn't really like him because he was a little player for a seventh grader. The one she always brings up is that I called her a hippo, and but I told her if she wanted to be my hippo, so I guess it was kind of romantic in a way. And as time went on, I kind of fell in love. Yeah, so the whole year we just flirted or whatever. and I had a big party for when I turned 13. Um, everyone was giving speeches, and I didn't know that Chandler was going to come up and give one. I gave a speech about how I told her whole family that they're going to be stuck with me because I was going to marry her. So we're gathered here today, obviously, to celebrate the union and the long-awaited marriage of Lexi and Chandler, and I'm blessed to be a part of this. birthday party Chandler announced to the whole entire world that was there and probably a few of the neighbors because it was extremely loud that he was going to marry Lexi no matter what any of us said and I remember I was <laughs> I was standing by Lexi's dad and Lex Wong gets up and goes what did he just say and I said <laughs> I said he said you better start saving Chandler, I love you very much, and I couldn't be more happier with my daughter's choice for a husband. <clears throat> we are so excited to see what the future holds for the two of you and what your dreams and goals are, and how as a couple, you guys are gonna grow together with the Lord. When I sat down and write these vows, it was clear that I could not possibly summarize what you have given to me in these past 11 years. You are patient, giving, determined, and loyal. You have nurtured our relationship and have shown everyone what a great man you are time and time again. I am so blessed to know you and so blessed to love you. Your patience in life helps guide me in ways I have never known. Because of you, I am a better person. And so lucky to have one of the most selfless, strongest, resilient girl to call, like one of my best friends. You inspire me with your wisdom, <laughs> your heart, your care for others. Wow, this is really hard. <laughs> <laughs> proud of the person she has evolved to be. 
especially the man she has chosen to spend her life with. Chandler, you are so perfect for her, and I know you'll take great care of her, and I have no doubt that you guys are going to have an amazing life together. To the young Lexi who would sit in class and write me letters signed, Mrs. Gustafson, we're here. Today is the day that we have been, that we have spent countless hours dreaming about. The day we hoped could get here faster and one we'll remember forever. To the woman I have grown to love over the past 11 years, I am thankful for you for simply being yourself. You have taught me that love is an action rather than just a word you use to express your emotions. To my beautiful wife, the woman of my dreams, to say I couldn't wait for this day would be an understatement. I've wanted to be your husband since we were kids, to love and respect you, to give you not only what you want, but what you deserve. Just nothing but the best from God, and I hope that you, you know, raise your kids to be little used because you guys are amazing people. Proud of you, Lexi. I'm very proud of you. I'm, 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 I'm happy to call you my daughter-in-law. I mean, it's when's the grandkids coming? Come on. <laughs> it's the moment you guys have all been waiting for. I now pronounce you man and wife. Chandler, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Thank everybody for being here. This is an amazing couple. It's a once in a lifetime uh, chance to witness a couple like this. So um, cheers to you guys and I love you both. <laughs>